It's the holidays. Does that mean you are your family's tech support? Here's some tips that'll help save your sanity. Ah, the holidays, the roasting meats, the luscious gifts, a chance to get together with your family and eat, share those gifts, catch up on gossip, and give tech support for their PCs, laptops, and smartphones. I mean, it's easier to do when you're physically there, but what about the rest of the year when you're away? Here are our top five tips. Number five, password manager. Brother forgot their password, their login, left the caps lock key on, whatever the issue, a password manager can help. They store passwords in an encrypted container, ensuring safety while offering convenience. They can even share passwords with you just in case you need to redo their security credentials. Coming in at number four, delegate email. If a family member delegates email access, you'll be able to read, send, and delete email messages, but you won't be able to make changes to their account, like their password. This is useful if you have a family member that maybe needs a little more help with their emails, maybe dealing with bills, stuff like that. Just make sure they understand you can read and respond to their emails. Up to number three, external hard drive and shared cloud storage. A large external hard drive in conjunction with their PC or Mac can do automated backup stuff that will come in handy if there's an OS corruption or data loss. And shared cloud storage lets you and your family members securely store and share files like important documents and photos. Sliding into number two, use FaceTime or Google Meet. If you're talking on the phone or you're texting and it's just not working, Get face to face so you can see what you're dealing with. When you can't drive or fly to a family member's house, a video call can be the next best thing. They can show you what the problem is and you can help them sort it out. At number one, remote desktop software. Remote desktop lets you run the PC or Mac remotely from another system, your system, over the internet. With a remote desktop installed, you can help your family member troubleshoot software problems, website access, even do maintenance chores like keeping a computer's operating system up to date. There are a number of free and paid remote desktop services, and some paid services even offer the ability to remotely control Android phones and iPhones. Being tech support for a family member is, it's a lot. These tools can help make that task easier and a little less stressful. Now, these aren't the only tips you may need. Share your own family tech support suggestions with the other members of the audience. And if you want more great tech news and info, subscribe to our channel, youtube.com slash daily tech news show. Get the podcast at dailytechnewsshow.com and support us on Patreon, patreon.com slash DTNS. I'll see you there. Thank you.